Okay guys, so we will begin with our workout now. Okay, हम वर्कआउट की अभी शुरुआत करते हैं और रियली अपॉलॉजीज फ्रॉम माई साइड क्योंकि परसों के दिन जब हमने वर्कआउट किया तब मेरा ऑडियो ऑफ था द माइक वॉज ऑन म्यू एंड सो यू कूड हेयर एनी थिंग पर आज के दिन आई हैव डबल चेक की वेदर द माइक इज वर्किंग और नॉट एंड इट्स वर्किंग जस्ट फाइन एंड वी विल स्टार्ट विद द वर्कआउट नाउ आई विल गेट स्टार्टेड विद द वर्कआउट तो सबसे पहले वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज दैट हम वही वर्कआउट करने वाले हैं जो उस दिन हमने किया था सो स्लाइटली आई कैन सी दैट माई हेड इज गेटिंग कट ऑफ सो लेट मी जस्ट एडजस्ट द कैमरा लिटल बिट थोड़ा सा मैं कैमरा एडजस्ट करता हूं एंड आई गेस दिस इज गुड नाउ दिस इज गुड परफेक्ट ओके सो दिस इज गुड नाउ ओके तो हम वही वर्कआउट करने वाले हैं जो उस दिन मैंने किया था सो आई आई विल डू द सेम वर्कआउट व्हाट आई डन बट विद लिटिल बिट ऑफ अ ट्विस्ट सो दैट देयर इज नो रेपिटेशन ओके सो दैट शॉर्ट ऑफ वर्कआउट इज वेरी गुड बिकॉज उससे आपका हार्ट रेट काफी बढ़ता है सो बिफोर यू नो टॉकिंग 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 लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड विद द वर्कआउट ओके सो शुरुआत करते हैं नेक रोटेशन से सो दिस टाइम वी आर गोइंग टू लॉक आवर हैंड्स बैक दिस वे एंड डू द नेक रोटेशन ओके लेट्स गो 1 2 3 just to get them activated so quarter step activation so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay now a little bit of the for the calves so we are going to do 1 2 3 4 5 and now 1 2 3 4 5 okay i want you to stand on your heels like this okay and walk for five steps forward and backwards 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 
Fine. Okay. Now bend this way and we'll walk like this. One, two, three, four, five. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I think we are quite relaxed now. Quite relaxed. Little bit for the knees because while doing squats, you obviously will feel, feel a little bit of pain. So do this very carefully, okay? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, guys. So I think we are completely warmed up. Let's get the heart rate up a little bit. Throw us a heart rate over lenge and uh, let's try to do that. So we'll do half squats, okay? Half squats means you have to just go down only till here and straight up, okay? So 20 half squats. On your mark, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Lovely. Okay, perfect. Now what we're going to do, we're going to start with our workout. So we'll do 20 counts first and then we'll do 20 counts more. Okay. So 20 counts we did was knee raises and then toe touch. Okay, knee raises and toe touch. So this time instead of going like this, we are going to basically bring our knee close and then two. Okay. So this is how we are going to do. So again from this side, close and then two. Okay. So we are going to do uh, 20 counts, which means both the legs is one count. So that way we are going to do 20 counts or total 20 counts we'll do and we'll do two sets. Okay. So, you know, one leg, one count. That's what we'll do. So let's get started. So keep your hands at the back. Nice. Okay. Let's go guys. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, sorry, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 19, 20, okay, keep marching, keep marching guys, keep marching, keep marching, very nice, very nice, keep going, keep going, keep marching, okay, sound is okay, sound is okay, keep marching, keep marching, very nice, okay, now we do one more round of the same, okay? Same exercise, one more round. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Bring your knees higher. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, come on, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Okay. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Great. Now we'll do sumo squats, okay? Sumo squats, but in the goblet style. So what we're going to do, we're going to keep our hands this way and we'll go down in sumo squats. So sumo squats means your legs are a little wide, your toes are pointing outwards and when you go down, your, your knees should travel in the direction of your toes, not inside, okay? They should go outside, okay, perfect. This way, goblet, and let's go, down, one, while coming up, squeeze your glutes, two, while coming up, push your knees outside, three, very good, four, five, very nice, push your knees outwards, six, we do twenty of these, seven, Eight. Excellent. Nine. Weight should be on the heels. Ten. Make sure your weight is in the heels. One. Two. Three. Four. Awesome. Five. Six. Seven, eight, deeper, nine, and ten. Wow, wow. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Keep going. Next is ice skaters, but ice skaters we are not going to jump. Okay? We are not going to jump. We are basically going to do ice skaters with reach out. Reach out means we will try to take this leg as far as possible okay as far as possible and you should feel a nice twist in this hip okay so you try to touch your hands down this way then we are going to change and reach out as much as possible and try to touch your hands down all throughout this workout we have to keep our weight in the heels make sure you don't tilt forward the weight is in the heels and that is going to give you a fantastic workout on your hips okay so today is hip focus slightly. Okay. Let's go. Don't jump, but reach out every time. Okay? So let's go. 20 of these. So reach out and down. One. Two. Three. You don't turn around. Four. Reach out. Farther. Five. Six. Awesome. Seven, eight, very nice, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, weight in the heels, nine, and ten. Walk, walk, keep walking, keep walking. This is giving a very nice twist in the hips, so that's what we want. Very, very focused on the glutes, very focused on the glutes. We are going to do 20 more, okay, 20 more. <laughs> Keep moving, keep moving, check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out, okay, perfect, ready, steady, and go, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, one. Wait in the heels. Two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, guys. This was also a bit tiring on the lower back. This was a little tiring on the lower back. So, but fine. We keep marching. We keep marching. Next exercise is squat and knee tap. Okay. So, squat and knee tap is we are going to squat and then we are going to just tap our knees. Get it down. Squat. Come up. Knee tap. Okay. So, we are going to keep our hands this way all the time. And squat is simple squat. So, we'll just do it now. <coughs> Today is very difficult on the lower body. So, that's what we are doing. Okay. Very tough on the lower body. Okay. Keep your hands at the back. This way. Okay. Basic squat. Okay. Push your hips back and down. Down. Up. Touch. Alternate. Two. Three. Go deep. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Come on, come on, come on. Seven. Eight. Nine and ten. Wow. Wow. Quadriceps on fire. Quadriceps on fire. Okay, sometimes doing it slow keeps your muscle under tension for a long time. And that's very good for your muscles because the longer time your muscle is under load or under tension, it's going to become stronger. Okay, very nice. Very nice. Keep going, keep going, get your breathing back, get your breathing back. If you have, okay, if you have elevated your heart rate a lot and try to do some workout, you will not have enough breath. So which means you will compromise on your range of motion and you will not do the reps correctly. That's why it's very important to get your breathing slightly lower, slightly lower, not too low but slightly lower. This is good now. Okay? So we do 20 more. Okay guys. And at the back. This way. Awesome. Okay. And let's go. One. Two. Three. Four. Slowly. Five. Six, seven, lovely, eight, nine, ten, come on, the last ten are important, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. Perfect. Keep going. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. Next one is inchworm with plant rotate. Okay? So inchworm means. We are going to be like this, this way, 
We are going to go down. Bend your knees slightly. Take your hands forward. This way. Once you are in this position, we are going to take one hand up, down, other hand up, down, and roll back again. Okay. So we are going to do seven of these. Seven of these inchworms, and we are going to take a break, and then seven more. Okay. So everybody in position properly. Okay. Let's go, guys. Up, down, forward, 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 forward. Stay there. One, two, and back. Down, two. Five more, come on. One, two, easy. While turning, make sure you protect your wrist. Down. When you are here, make sure you are absolutely on your toes. Okay, on your toes. One, two, back. Come on, three more. Down, straight. One, two. Down, two more, come on. Straight, turn, turn, and back. Last one, straight, down, turn, turn, and back. Okay, lovely. Keep marching. Keep marching. This has really activated the core and core is also what we want. Okay, core is also something that we really want to develop. So, very nice. We have seven more to go. Seven more. Just get your breathing back. Okay, seven more. Here we go. Down. Straight, turn, turn, back. No jerky movements. Smooth movements, good for the wrist. Protect your wrist. One, two, if you can't rotate, you can simply go down in inch one and come up. Turn, turn, four more, come on, three more. Come on, balance two more. Last one. Lovely. Okay. So we did seven and seven. Very nice. Next one is again for the hips, specifically for the glutes. So what we are going to do is we are going to go down in dog position. We are going to get our legs inside and then completely travel it outwards. Okay. So let me show you how it is to be done. 
So what we are going to do is this way. Go down in dog. Like this. Very nice. Drop position. Heels on the floor. Okay, heels on the floor. Make sure your heels are touching the floor. Okay. And we are going to get one leg inside. And the same leg we are going to extend outwards. So inside. Outwards. Inside. Outwards. Okay. So we are going to do 10 on one leg and then 10 on the other. Let's go. Heel on the floor at all times. This leg bent. Try to get it in as much as possible. Okay? Let's go. 1. Extend. Keep your knees straight. 2. Extend. 3. 4. 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, lovely, okay, now the other side, heels on the floor and let's go, 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay. Now, wipe yourself. We are going to do ten more. Ah. You are going to feel your hips fantastically tomorrow okay? and you are going to remember me ok very nice once again go down, downward dog this way, first class heels on the floor get one leg in and then up one two three four five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lovely. Now the other leg. And chin it in. Heels on the floor. And here we go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Wow. Wow. Very nice. Okay. Okay. Quite nice. Okay. Next one, we are going to do hip thrusters, but hip thrusters with slight upward movement okay so let me grab my mat you can also get your mat we need a mat okay okay so I'm back with my mat this way okay let's fold it I see okay so this is what we do we're going to go down, hip thrusters, okay, which means we get our hips up like this, and then we are going to take one leg up like this. So one, two, alternate legs, and we're going to do ten, you know, five, five on each leg, go down, and then do one more set. But all through the exercise, make sure that your hips are really pushed to the maximum level, okay? Keep your hips pushed to the maximum level. Okay. So up. This is my max now. Okay. Hands down. And let's go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, 
10. I think we can do 10 more. Come on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Wow. Wow. This is really fantastic on the hips. I'll change my angle slightly this time for a different view. Okay? So I'll change it to this angle just for you to see. So we are going to do 10 10 again. Okay? So total 20. That's what we'll do now. Okay. Okay. Lovely. I guess you are able to see this. Yes. You are able to see this. Ha. Perfect. Okay. Let's go down. Let's go down. Right. Okay. Hands on the floor. Push your hips up. Maximum. Maximum. And let's go. One. Two. Keep your hips up. Three. Four. Five. Six. Up. Seven, eight, hips up, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Wow, this was super guys, this was super, really awesome, fantastic workout, okay, so now we move on to the core, okay, enough of the lower body, now we move on to the core, so first in the core exercises, we are going to do wipers with our legs together, okay, so the good way to do is keep your knees as close to each other as possible, so if you have a dupatta or a string to just you know tie around your knees, it will be even more effective. But right now we just managed to do it this way. So what is wipers? Wipers are you have to take your legs this way and don't lift your elbows. Elbows are down on the ground. And then this way. Elbows are down on the ground. Three. Okay? This way. So we'll do. 20 of these, 2 0. Right up? Okay. Straight. Elbows on the ground. Up, 90 degrees. Knees together. And let's go. 1, 2. Keep breathing. 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine, ten more, come on, ten, one, two, three, try not to lift your elbows, four, five, six, you should be getting the strain now. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow. As you can see, I started going downwards. I started going downwards, okay? So we'll do just one set of this, one set of this, and then we are going to move on to the leg raises, okay? We're going to do the leg raises now. So how is it that we do? Okay, so this is how we do. So we go down like this. Next straight, extend it. Keep your hands on the side. Preferably, you can keep your hands back. But if that's too difficult, keep your hands here. Or if that's too difficult too, you can simply place them under your hips, this way, and you can do it. Okay? I'll keep it outwards. I'll just catch the mat. Okay, and mark. Next straight. And go. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come on, come on, do at least fifteen. One, two, three, four, and five. Oof, I could manage only 15. Oof. If you're able to do 20, go for it, guys. Go for it. Go for it. Okay. Okay. Now we'll do the next exercise. Next exercise again for the core and what we are going to do is basically we are going to get so we are going to go down this way and we are going to come up and fold our legs inside and bring our ch chest upwards and touch the heels which means one, two, three. Got it? So we try to do 20. At least try to do 15. Okay? But I'm going to go for 20 this time. Let's see if I can make it. Okay. Any mark? Okay. Let's bring some double cushion. Okay. Okay. Any mark? Good. And go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Come on, ten more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and hold. And ten. Wow. Wow. This was amazing on the court. This was amazing. Okay. So guys, this is really fantastic. So what we did today is that we have really strained our glute muscles a lot. So in the stretching part, we are also going to uh, you know stretch the glute muscles well. So along with glute muscles, the inside of our thighs have also been stretched. So we are going to stretch that as well. So let's get down to the stretching now. Okay, we are done with our workout. So I want you to spread your mat this way. I just want it to be wide enough so that your, your knees can rest on it. Okay? So you have to keep your knees spread this way. Keep your legs touched. Okay, legs should be joined behind. And I am going to go front like this. Okay, down on my down on my elbows like this and I'm going to push back one two three four five the inside of your thighs should get stretched six seven eight lovely nine and 10. Wow. Wow. Okay. Up, 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 up. Now, for some glute stretches, okay? So, first of all, we are going to keep our hands, uh, legs this way and turn your leg this way, okay? And grab your leg with both hands like this, okay? And just pull this knee towards your chest. Try to sit straight, pull your knee towards the chest so you will get a nice stretch on your hips. That's what we want. Nice stretch, sit straight, pull your knee as close as possible. As close as possible and just feel the stretch. You have to feel the stretch. Sit straight, feel the stretch. Feel the stretch. Wow. Okay. Release. Now, what we do is with the other leg now, so with the other leg, this way, grab it with both hands, 
and stretch. Feel the stretch over here. Wow. So if you are not able to feel the stretch so much, you can push this knee outwards. Okay, try and push this knee outwards. So automatically you will get more stretch. Sit straight, that will increase the stretch. Lovely. Okay. I think that's enough. That's enough. Okay. Now a little bit more again for the glutes. So this time we're going to go down. So let me change the angle slightly. Okay. So now what we are going to do is we're going to go down, keep our leg this way, okay? And we're going to thread the needle, okay? As if this is a needle hole, we are going to thread the needle and keep your catch your shin this way and pull it towards yourself. Your head is down on the floor. Head is down on the floor. Now to bring some extra stretch, you can keep your hands slightly over here and try to pull this knee closer. You will get an excellent stretch in your hips. Excellent stretch in your glutes. Feel the stretch, feel the stretch. Okay, release. Very nice. We repeat the same with the other leg. One leg is always difficult than the other. Okay. Thread the needle. And here we go. Bring it closer. Bring it closer. Wow. And release. Excellent. Now we do a little bit for the back because we have also done some lower body and lower back exercises. So, we are going to do cat camel. So, in cat camel, we are going to push our waist down. So, the belly button is pushing towards the floor and I am going to basically arch my back this way, looking upwards, like this. So, this is the camel position. Now, we do cat position. So, I am going to pull my hips inside. I am going to raise my upper back. And as you can see, my back is completely rounded now. That is what we want. And cat again. And from cat we go to camel. Like this. Up. Down. That's it. Now a little bit relax, a uh, little relaxing for the quadriceps. So I'm going to just turn it into half this way. I'm going to sit down like this over here and relax. Okay. So this is for the quadriceps. So make sure you are sitting nicely on your hips sitting nicely on your hips. If you find it this too difficult, you can take some support if you want, but that's okay if you, if you take some support. This is a stretch, not just for the quads, it's very good for the shins, it's very good for the ankles, so you will get a good stretch on your almost the entire lower body, okay? So we are going to sit like this for about a minute, okay? For one minute we are going to sit like this, okay? So what we did today is that we, we did a lot of glute focused exercises. We did a lot of glute focused exercises and these exercises will make your uh, the, the gluteus muscles really strong. Now with these muscles strong, you will be able to exert a lot of force whenever you are doing any lower body movements like squats, like kicking, like jumping. So your glutes really get engaged in all of these exercises. Glute muscles are really strong muscles, okay? So in order to make them stronger, you really need to apply a lot of load and a lot of pressure. 
unless you don't apply a lot of pressure, it's not going to work for you, okay? So make sure that you really strengthen your lower body because that is sometimes that is neglected and then all sorts of hip related problems crop up in the later years. So it's not possible to do a lot of glute exercises right from the beginning, but you can slowly build yourself up to that level. Okay, I guess we have done with one minute. So with some support, come up this way. Okay, just shake your legs, shake your legs so that they don't fall off to sleep. Okay, shake your legs. Very nice. Okay. So guys, we are done with a fantastic workout. I want you to shower up. I want you to get ready and be there with me in a couple of minutes for our next edition of the online nutrition club. Okay. So till then, have a fantastic week ahead and see you. Bye-bye.